Folks, we're in Hotchkiss, Colorado for the Steve Reuter estate auction. And we have a very clean CM Trailers, two horse bumper hitch trailer. I think it's a 94, I'll verify that with the title. And we do have a clean Colorado title on this. And so I just wanted to do a quick walk around video for you and kind of give you a good idea of what kind of condition this trailer is in. And I apologize for the wind. I know it makes the videos hard to hear. And I wish that we could get by without it. But unfortunately, it's springtime. So I'll start up here on the front. We have a two inch ball with the, uh, I call it a six prong plug. With the trailer lights. The hitch and the jack appear to be good. The jack does work. There's a little damage on the guard or the trim, whatever you want to call that, around the nose. You can see that right there. But other than that, I think the trailer's in pretty good shape. And we'll walk around so you guys can take a look. So we're here on the right hand side on the front. That door opens right up. And it is in good shape. You've got your spare tire. You can see that we've got rubber mats across the entire trailer. If I peel this little corner up, I think you can see the boards look good. The floor looks good. So I think it's good all the way through, guys. You've got your divider here in the front. You'll notice here in the front, there is no feed area. You've just got your rub bar right there for your horse to come up against. and. So you could store some stuff up here in the front or, or something like that. The roof on this trailer looks like it's in very good shape on the inside. I'll take a look from the outside so you guys can be sure of that as well. But it uh, looks good here on the front. So let's shut this door. And we'll come on down the side here. And I think everything looks good down the side, guys. There's a... A little ding or two on the fender wells that I'll show you here in just a moment. The front part of the fender well looks good, but you can see they've, they've done something right here where they've caught something. So a little minor damage right there, nothing material. The tires look good. The tires look really good. I don't see a lot of weather check. I don't see hardly any weather check, and the tread's very good on the tires. So we'll come around here to the back. So you can see you've got the, what I call the barn door gates, or the fold out gates on top, and then the fold down gate on the bottom. So let's open these up. So there's the right hand side. There's the left hand side. The doors look good, guys. I don't think this little trailer has seen much use. This is a pretty clean little two horse trailer. So in typical Mr. Reuter fashion, I've noticed he likes rubber snubbers and baling twine. <laughs> so, give me just a second here. Get that up, move that out, undo this. There's a process here. Bring this that one up, bring that one out. And this door should fold down. A little stiff, guys. It's been a day or two. Okay. So that's what, that's what we look like from the back end. You can see you've got your rub bar for the front and the rear for your horse on each side. Got your divider gate with the bumper in the middle. I'm standing on this door here on the back, guys, and I, I feel like it's pretty solid. When you get to the outside edge, I feel like it gives a little bit more like right in here. I think you're okay for a long time. You'll definitely want to put some WD-40 on your hinges. But guys, my goodness, this is a clean little trailer. Holy cow. And it looks like the doors all swing and function the way they should. I guess I can't do that until I put the gate up. Sorry about that. So we'll see if we can't get the gate. And you can see the gate's actually off the ground. Those springs are still got some tension in them. Definitely need some WD-40. There's that one. There's that one. 
There's that one. Then, <laughs> that door shut there. A little WD-40 all the way around on the ba on the gates. Sure wouldn't hurt, guys. So now, let's come down here on the left-hand side. And as on the right-hand side, there's just a little damage right here. Nothing material. Tires still look good. And we're back up here on the front. So what I'm going to do, I've got this other trailer sitting right here. So this is going to work pretty nice, I hope. That's what it looks like up on top, guys. And, and this little guy was stored outside. Guys, it was not in the shed. Um, but that being said, what a clean little two-horse trailer. So we'll go ahead and put her up on auction time for you. And it'll be on Equipment Facts, I'm sorry. Put it up on Equipment Facts for you, and you guys can either bid online, or we'd like to have you out in Hotchkiss with us on the 23rd. So if you have any questions, give me a call, guys. Thanks.